What's going on, YouTube world? Uh, my name is uh, Chris. The gamer tag that Johnson Swag I play on Xbox 360. Um, I'm be posting uh, videos on my channel of my actual gameplay, whether it be uh, Call of Duty, Red Dead Redemption, or Battlefield. I pretty much play uh, anything that uh, I can get my hands on at that point in time. Uh, if you have any suggestions, let me know on what I should uh, check out. Maybe create some gameplay of it. Uh, I either go rent it or if it if it's a good enough game, I'll I'll go out and buy it. Um, but this commentary is not really going to be focusing on the gameplay. It's a uh, more of an introduction to who I am and and what's going on and and stuff like that. Uh, so uh, just so you know, I'm uh, 22 years old. I have three kids, and as of right now, I, me and my family just moved to uh, Hudson, Florida, with absolutely nothing to do out here. I hate it out here, but it will do for right now. So about me, I play video games, as you as you can obviously tell. This will be my my first commentary that I would ever put up on YouTube. I've posted a couple videos here and there every now and then. I used to have another channel, but I, I deleted that and took it off because I really wasn't uh, I wouldn't say not doing too well it's just if you're not a commentator no one really watches your videos you don't get that many views I'm not I'm not doing it for subscribers I'm doing it so I can get some uh, a whole bunch of views people tell me what they think about my videos and, and stuff like that as you can see in this one I'm, I'm not doing too well right now but pretty soon here in the video I, I pretty much go on a tear after I think uh, I think I die after this death. I, I die one more time, and then I go on a tear. It's just these guys, man. At long range, you gotta put so many bullets into them during when I was playing this game. I think there was one guy. His name was Number Eleven Thirty Six Eighteen or something like that, and that that's his name. Real creative, but um. I keep on just pumping bullets into him right over here. I think I think the part's coming up. He's just sitting on the roof over there, not moving. And I'm pumping bullets into him, and, and he's just not dying at all. But this, I'm 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 real fond of this game. I like this game. It's just that a lot of these matches is is about who can get the higher grounds and stay up there the longest at the same time and getting kills. That's all. I seem to see anybody doing is just camping on top of buildings and and trying to get their kills. It's not like you have kill streaks in this game. It's, it's supposed to be fun. It's not competitive at all. It's not like Call of Duty, where it's it's let's let's hide in the corner and see what high kill streak I can get or get in the lobby and nuke boost and and stuff similar to that. Is is. I don't know, I had to take a break from Call of Duty, which is why I went out and bought this, and I also bought Battlefield Bad Company, too, because either you're in the lobby with a bunch of boosters, or or you're pretty much just sitting in there and just noob tubes, one-man army, danger clothes. The community right now for, for Call of Duty is pretty much just it's, it's, it's shit right now, because no one wants to play the game the way it was made to be played. They want to play the game the easiest way possible, which is if it's for them, Noob 2 is one man army and just camping somewhere or or whatever it is they may do is just is making the community terrible and and I feel everybody needs to just, just stop the bullshit and shoot your gun, whether, you know, I was playing a match the other day on February and the whole team is running around in the city, like in the middle of the board with commando pro and attack knife that's 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 not fun how is that that fun for anybody you know is you run around the corner and there's a guy sitting in the corner and just lunges 20 feet and fucking slices your head off this is i think it's pretty lame but i still play the game i love the game with that being said um i'll probably say battlefield is uh Battlefield is, 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 is a good game for a change of pace. It's, it's more of a team-oriented base. This game, um, 
I seem to have been playing not a lot. I, I've gained level really fast in that, but the thing with that is you you can't go in there by yourself with no friends. I, pr I pretty much talked to quite a few of my friends to either going out and, and buying it or, or renting it and tell, basically telling me their thoughts on it. We've been going back and forth between Battlefield and Call of Duty, and now I've gotten this. And this I love. You, you see, this is probably about my third or fourth online game other than doing the free roam because you can pretty much get ranked doing anything in this game you could do the free roam to get ranked or or you can get on in these online matches for a while it wouldn't let me in these online matches but now i got everything straight and i'm in these online matches and it's it's crazy fun it's it's very interesting it's it's third person which is something i'm not too fond of but but i, I love this game and right right here after playing a couple matches online and recording a lot of footage i think last night i got probably about six hours of footage of actual gameplay stayed up till about four in the morning but pretty much got the hang of it and, and i think this is the part where i go on the tear and they they can't kill me for a while and i'm just i'm just tearing them apart and there's this one one part where I, two guys spawn clearly where i can see them and i just tear them apart and one of my teammates get the other kill but I, i'm playing this pretty much for fun and it's something different from Call of Duty, and pretty much—I don't even know how to explain it—but it's a—it's a great all-around game. This period with the graphics, the, the controls are a little clunky, and it's difficult for me to learn controls. The weapon wheel—I'm still trying to get the hang of how to switch my weapons out quickly. Like when I run out of ammo and I'm in the middle of a gunfight, I—you'll see in the video. I think at the very end. I try to switch to my pistol. I'm not in the gunfight, but I try to switch to my pistol and, and start shooting. But I start swinging, swinging my knife at I don't know, God knows what I was swinging the knife at. And it's 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 just a fun all-around game. And here's the part where the two guys just spawn right across the board. One guy tries to hop on top of the building, but uh. <clears throat> As far as this game goes, I recommend everyone at least rent it and try it out. It, it, it's a great game. If, if you're in online gameplay, the story mode is, is awesome. Um, what else about this game? Horse riding. If, you, if you're in an online match, free roam, of course, you can, you can get your horse and, and just go out and tear people up or fly around. Uh, fly around the map. It's the easiest way to get around the map. But if, if you're playing it, and uh, I think it's grab or hold your own. I think it may be where you could. It's basically like grab the bag, and it's team based, and you could just run around and go and take basically take people's bags and bring them back to your base. But you could also call your horse in to make the trip a lot faster. I would say because some of the maps I've learned that some of the maps in this game are pretty big so if you if you have your if you have your horse you'll be able to basically just tear through the map and, and hurry up and get over there and get the back and get back to your side it's, this game takes some strategy but it's it's not a lot at all it's just it's basically just run out there and have fun but then you'll get, sometimes you get in the matches i guess where people are just sitting on top of buildings and they just won't move this it's like everyone's too worried about their kill death ratio than to actually go out and have some fun. And I don't I don't see why that is, but I think the game is coming to a close pretty soon here. I'm not really sure. But I just want to introduce myself and uh get this out there. Uh if you have any suggestions about what games I should be playing or or what, what gameplay you would like to see, just let me know and uh, I'll get it to you. This is uh the Johnson Swag and I'm out. I hope you enjoyed my commentary. Subscribe, comment, rate. I really appreciate it.